your storm is over your storm is over welcome back to waffle ministries dr angela here i'm so excited to have you here welcome to the broadcast wherever you're tuning in from around the globe i love you with the love of christ jesus loves you so much never forget that and the word for today is your storm is over i don't know what you've been facing I don't know what you've been through. I don't know what your situation is. But God is saying today that your storm is over. He's already taking care of what you need. And God said he's sending angelic help for you to get you out of that place. I understand. Oftentimes I think about this story. But I understand Peter, he was toiling all night. He was crying all night because he was fishing all night. But there was no fruit of his labor. There was nothing to show. He could not catch nothing. And all it took was one word, my God. And God told him to put your net on the right side and drop it. And as soon as he put his net on the right side and dropped it, Everything changed immediately. Everything changed. He caught more than enough, my God. And the situation changed just like that. He went from making nothing to making more than enough. And many of you are in a place of stagnation. Maybe you have enough. But God said, I'm giving you more than enough in this due season. Understand that what you're facing right now, it is over. The storm is over. The tears that you had to cry, the pain that you had to go through, the suffering that you went through, the nights where it did not make sense to you. You didn't understand it. You didn't know what was going on, but you knew something is off. But the enemy has been giving you hell because he sees where God is about to take you. Understand. The enemy does not mess with you because of what you're in right now or how it looks. The enemy messes with you because he sees where you're going and he tries to stop you from getting there. But I want you to know that the battle is won. God has fought the battle for you and the storm is over. And so it's time for you to cry tears of joy. You had enough pain, you had enough suffering, you had enough struggling, and now it's time for recompense. The enemy has to pay you back for what he's stolen from you. And the Bible says that God is restoring to you the years that the locusts have eaten what was yours. Understand, understand that God is sending for you. Many of you are getting married. I see new marriages coming. My God, it's your Boaz and Ruth moment. And so get your heart and mind prepared for that. Many of you, your finances are about to change overnight. And a lot of you were in situations where maybe you might have been even sleeping in your car. You might have been on somebody's couch. My God, you might have been struggling just to get your kids food or school supplies. But that storm is over. The money that God is sending you, you've never seen it before. You've never touched it before, my God. You are about to testify of the goodness of the Lord. You are about to see it with your own eyes and you are about to physically touch it. Many of you are receiving keys. You're receiving keys to brand new homes. You're receiving keys to brand new cars. I'm not talking about old. I'm talking about everything new because God says I'm doing a new thing. In the now. And so the old is past and the new has begun. Get ready to receive everything that God has for you. I would encourage you to sow into the word of the Lord. Sow into the word of the Lord, each and every one of you. Connect your faith. Touch and agree with the word. And understand today that the storm is over. I love you, family. And remember, the joy of the Lord is your strength. God bless you.